What's up, people? So, a little quick intro on my balcony. <laughs> Just about to head off to this uh, independent gym to hit this workout. I've got my pre-workout here, which I'm gonna have in a second. And yeah, this is gonna be a pool day, so enjoy. And if you guys are here, I appreciate you for coming and watching. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube. As I said, I'm committing to weekly uploads. Being on TikTok and doing this, it's been a huge process and just a crazy journey so far. I appreciate the support. And I'm actually recording this uh, the day after and I'm absolutely shattered from this workout. So look forward to the footage. Here's the outfit. Little oversized hoodie, athlete pants. This is from a brand Kintori from Australia. So that's kind of sick. But yeah, let's go and get this workout in. And here we are, the entrance to Ibi Ultimate Fitness, spelled 18Y Ultimate Fitness. As I said before, man, it's just one of my favorite gyms and it's one of those places where it, it's an example of how having a great environment can just make you feel pumped and make you get a better workout. So yeah, check this place out. MMA Octagon upstairs. Man, this is such a great place. And it's only like an eight or nine minute cycle from me. So today I was hitting a pull day, so back biceps, rear delts. So they've actually got things lined up. So all of these machines in this row are basically back. I started off this chest supported row. It's a bit like a T-bar row, a kind of like a seal row as my first heavy compound, but the angle was very different. I just wanted to try it because I hadn't seen this. It seems like an uncommon piece of equipment and it feels pretty good. You can change the angle of the, uh, the chest pad and I hit this for four sets. So yeah, not too busy. I've met the owners of this place too. This was on a Sunday afternoon, not busy at all. Super cool people. They've built this gym as a passion project to give back to the community. And you can just really see that, you know, the posters are on top, the anime posters, just a great place. And this is one of my favorite pieces in the gym, a Nautilus pull down. Now, the unique, the unique thing about Nautilus pull downs or Nautilus equipment is the handles. You can see the way they swivel and rotate. So it means you can get a really perfect line of pull to hit whatever muscles you want. So for this, I can get my elbow really deep into the back pocket, line up with the lat fibers perfectly to shorten them perfectly. So great exercise. This is four sets as well. So now we've done a row and a pull down. We're going to some single sided exercises. So this is an underhand pull down. I'm doing one side at a time. And I really like this just because it allows me to lean to one side and really, again, hit that lat, basically really shorten it. And for me, if you have imbalances or, you know, a bit of curvature in your spine, doing single side at a time like this is really important, particularly for the lats, just to make sure things are contracting correctly. Man, this looks good, man. This was a great workout. 4K footage looking. Peng, feeling good, man. Arms popping. You see the lights turn on. They turn on these lights underneath the uh, MMA octagon as it gets darker. Get short, you see that little, finish, finish that final rep. And yeah, it's about intensity sometimes. Some of these workouts where I go to a different gym, it's, it's because I want this intense environment. And so, anyway, next up. This is a Nautilus pullover. So you guys might have seen me talk about this. Quite a famous piece of equipment. It's, a, it's a synonymous with Dorian Yates, famous bodybuilder from the area. And this is one of those things where it really hits the lats, really gets that arcing motion into the hip to really shorten the lat, isolating it. A bit like a cable pullover. And I mentioned this earlier, one of my favorite things about this place is the wall art. You've got Goku, you've got Baki. They added some new people. You've got Vegeta over there on the left. You've got Ryu from Street Fighter over there. That's just a nice cool touch, you know what I'm saying? So having done all of the back movements, now we're hitting some bicep isolations. And this is just a, a plate loaded preacher curl, which is a bit different actually, but man, look at the footage. Damn, it looks good, man. Guys, I'm just excited to be producing this content every week, committing to it, getting better and better. And it just, it just feels good to, to work on this thing. It's something I wanted to do for a long time, YouTube. And the next up is an incline curl, just on the machine, keeping it simple, high reps, uh, we did three sets of both of these uh, bicep movements. Your boy's looking like he's on that vegan creatine out here. Jeez, look at them rear delts. <laughs> so we're hitting some of these uh, rear delt flies now. Again, just it's a simple reverse pec deck basically. And for me, this is a, a good movement to finish up. But yeah, man, the lats are popping, the rear delts, the biceps. Honestly, this low angle is kind of not great for me, but let's check out the that spread from the back. Sheesh. Okay. 
I'm not gonna lie, man. I'm I'm enjoying this process, and, and for anyone who's watching, I always recommend you to focus on enjoying the process. Just enjoying your training. This is the, probably the best shot of my back from this workout. Look at that pump. The rear delts pop in. The traps. The 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 lats looking thick. That demons popping out. That Bucky style demon. Biceps kind of getting there. We're getting there. Biceps have always been something I needed to work on more. Try and get that double front double by pose. And uh, we went to get some food nearby. This is a Yemeni place. So basically this is a lamb kofta. Hit the spot for sure. And so yeah, I got this meal down and then cycled my ass home and basically passed out because I was just completely shattered. But that's the video for the week, guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure you subscribe. More content coming. We're just going to keep getting better at our craft. I will see you next time. Peace.